what's going on guys welcome back to the country channel this is another haul and let me quickly go over what we're looking at here this box here is Lego shop at home order this is what I got at the Lego retail store this here blue bag is from Toys R Us and this small white box is an order I placed through Citizen Brick and quite excited to receive this let's go ahead and start with the big box first the shop at home order here Look, some bubble wrap, and as you can see, it is the Crook Island. This is currently on sale on Lego Shop at Home. I'm not crazy about this set, really. We had so many helicopters in the past and all that, but I did really like the large rock element that I'll be using for my underwater scene, and uh, just a lot of the uh, masonry bricks and stuff. So I really got this for the parts. So I'll be parting this out to use for my mocks and such. And I did buy two of these with the uh, $35 order. I give you the free Milano. And uh, I got a couple of those already. And uh, here's my local Lego store haul. Let me just dump it out. But first of all, I got another Milano because I was at the store. There's another one. And for my previous hauls, I had uh, two more Milanos. That makes four Milanos. I'm not purposely making all these multiple purchases to, to get this Milano. I mean, it's nice to get a freebie, but you know, it's like I'm not that really into Guardians of the Galaxy. But again, it's nice to get free Lego. So you know, I guess you know, if I have to spend a little bit more just to get some free Lego, you know, I'll do that. I'll I'll, I'll take it. And it's in the calendar here. Uh, just want to point out this uh, this canvas they're giving out on the 15th next month. We gotta spend 200 bucks. That is crazy. I've seen freebies where you have to spend 100 bucks, but rarely like 200 bucks. But this canvas bag is pretty nice. So I think I might just have to go spend 200 bucks and get some just to pick up this canvas bag. So I'll probably do that. I'm wondering what the, uh, the early release for the 15th is. Because it's not the carousel. Carousel is coming out on the 1st. So I'm kind of wondering. Uh, if you have a good guess, let me know down in the comments because I have no idea what that's going to be. Of course, uh, probably the week prior, I could probably call the store and find out and the store personnel will let me know. But yeah, there's that. I did pick up two of these Easter sets and it was on sale for 8 bucks. I did miss out on this when it was on sale for like $7.50 I think, something like that. On Shop at Home uh, Lego website. I missed out on it, but when I started the store, I was like, yeah, I'll go ahead and pick a couple of them up. Uh, again, this really not interested in the scene or anything, and the minifigures are kind of generic. But again, it comes with pretty good elements, like the masonry bricks and stuff like that. So uh, basically, I got this for parts also, you know, for mocks. And, oh, some of these are all like spilling out, but I picked up another pick a brick cup smaller one this time just some random stuff um, and there's some brown or reddish brown 2x4 bricks picked up some of those that those green stuff are a special project which I'll be doing a video later on um, doesn't really have to do with my channel but it has to do with Lego something outside of YouTube but um, I'll share with you guys what I'm doing with those but there's that and then again some more collectible minifigures. Now I got like two boxes. And you're thinking, what do I need more uh, CMF for? But as I mentioned on that video, all the two boxes, not, not all of them were mine. So uh, I did want to pick up a few more. And these are the ones that come three in a box. The ones that come four or five in a box, I do have extra of. But ones that come three in a box, I don't have extra. So I figured I'd go uh, pick some up. And the, uh, I believe two of them is the surfer dude. And one of them is the veterinarian. Let's take a look at the Toys R Us. And we had like a gift card for some reason. We made, I don't know what, but my wife had some gift cards. And I have some gift cards. So we're like, you know what? We're here. Let's, you know, let's go ahead and just spend it. And I did find uh, pretty cool stuff. So more CMF. Three more CMF. Series 17. My daughter wanted the little butterfly girl. And so we picked that for her. And just cut all random ones. Warrior pack. The brick warriors. So the little accessory packs. 
I did a review a long time ago on, on uh, these, but these are more like kind of like random pieces. The one I bought had like it had a complete theme. Like if it was the army guy, it had, like came with all the army accessory, or if you had the knight, it came with all the accessory. These are more like random pieces. It just comes like a helmet, just random stuff. Because this thing is for like a knight, I think. And then there's some hammers and stuff. So it's just random. But I I bought these because they were on clearance for a dollar. So I thought, hey, why not? Pick those up, and this, these are the Duplo little poly bags, and uh, I really did like the elephant that I could probably put in my city along with other animals, and my daughter wanted one, so I did pick up an extra one, one for her and one for me. The Sism brick that I placed an order for, and uh, quite excited about this one because uh, I really uh, like what I saw on their website and their custom uh, Lego, so. And I'm uh, excited to show you guys. They are pretty darn cool, I think. I bought the uh, Neil deGrasse Tyson a little while ago, and uh, yeah, I was extremely happy with it. So uh, I'm sure these won't disappoint. It will work here. First of all, let me show you the, these two here. I, why I like Scissor Brick is that they're pad printed, meaning I guess they're like basically printed the same way Legos print them, so they're pretty durable. And I uh, picked up another Infected Zone. Uh, printed tile. I bought one of these before with their uh, minifigures, um, custom minifigures, but at the time I was thinking, man, I really should have ordered another one, so uh, when I was passing order for this one, I thought, you know, I'll throw in another one. And with the infected zone, it goes well with the keep out sign. And I know LEGO makes the printed keep out sign also from one of the sets. <sighs> Which one was it? It was like Lone Ranger set or something. But I thought it'd be nice to have like different uh, types of keep out signs on a mock. Uh, you know, it's just the variation kind of makes it look nice instead of seeing the same keep out sign over and over. So there's that uh, little thing. Uh, here are the two that minifigure I was really looking forward to. First one is the zombie waitress. Very cool. I really like the zombie minifigures and I have a mock that I'll be doing in regards to zombie. So she'll fit really nicely. Um, and you know, just looking at her torso. I feel like she'll go really nicely with the Series 17, the hot dog guy. You know, the guy with the hot dog in a tray. Because they were wearing like very similar shirt. So I think it just looked really nice uh, to go together. I mean, obviously he's not a zombie, but I'll run the picture at the end side by side kind of thing uh, with her and that uh, Series 17 hot dog guy. Just as a comparison. Uh, not really a comparison, but just a little side by side thing. So yeah, Zombie Waitress, and the other one is U.S. Marine Corps Dress Blue minifigure, really cool, love all the printing. Now they do make a, a C uniform, which is basically like a, like a tan a torso one, different uniform. I think this is more like a formal dressed up kind of one, and then the C one is more for like everyday kind of uniform kind of thing, but yeah. I actually like this one better, so yeah, very cool. Now I'll have a marine in my city. So there it is. Thanks for uh, stopping by. Thanks for watching, and thanks for checking out my little haul here. Uh, as always, please give a thumbs up if you like watching haul videos, and if you're new to my channel, feel free to subscribe. Uh, thanks for stopping by. This is Brick Country signing out, and I'll catch you on the next video. Bye.